How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you today. As always, hope you're all having a fantastic day, wherever you guys might be. Uh, we had a lot of fun yesterday in my live stream viewer lobby playing with you guys. That was a lot of fun. And if you didn't make it, no worries guys. I'm going to try to live stream at least once or twice every week. So be sure you're subscribed and have that notification bell turned on. So that way, when I do go live, you will get notified. Anyways, today we're going to be dedicating this video to Volkov. And I know I've been playing a lot of Volkov lately, but I'm trying to level him up to level 25, but also just to train Axe and Scythe. I think that they're two of the best Volkov. weapons in the game right now. And I want to try to get really high in ranked 1v1 this season. So uh, I'm doing a little bit of ranked, a little bit of viewer lobbies. A little bit of just training the legend every now and then. And uh, training doesn't mean that I'm going to win every game, probably. I mean, that's not the goal, per se. I'm just practicing uh, sight strings, movement, positioning, uh, all that good stuff. Three, Going against two, Dan one, Shadow. Roll. Sentinel. I like Sentinel. The fun thing about doing viewer lobbies, live streams, is that I usually will let you guys pick my legend. And because of that, I get to play like every legend. So I got to play Sentinel a little bit yesterday. And it was fun. I don't like being on the edge right here. I think I should be able to get him with this scythe. There it is. He was trying to do a fancy move. He was trying to do a uh, gravity cat, so D light. Getting him pretty good with my axe. Oh boy, I got him with that bomb holla. That's what we're talking about. GG dude, GG. That was a that was a good game. Good warm-up game. We eat noobs! I just realized that was his clan. Hey, finally level 18 Volkov. I remember I was watching Noel live stream. He's a Brahala pro. I was watching him live stream uh Volkov like a week or two ago. And he was warming he was practicing Volkov as well because he wants to use Volkov in the Brahala tournaments. And he was already level 18 Volkov back then, like a week or two ago. Volkov. So I'm finally caught up to him. <laughs> it took so long. And now I have, what, seven more levels to go. It's going to take me probably at least another couple weeks just to get black colors Volkov. And that's okay. I can't wait. All right, go to guess Bearable. This guy is really good, Taros. So I'm pretty sure he's Diamond. Pretty sure I played him before, but the name rings a bell, but at the same time, I don't think I played him, like, super recently. The thing with Taros is he has really long startup 
animations on his six. So as long as I dodge those, I should be fine, really. Got him. I'm feeling a little bit of lag. I think it's just my computer. I don't know why. I just got a brand new computer. It's like super powerful and every now and then feels like I'm lagging. There you go, Taros. Gotta get a good neutral stick. Gimp in there! At least once a game, right? Got you, boy! Got you in the face! I knew he'd get me at least once with some kind of Taros gimp, whether it was the hammer or the axe. Although I gotta say, he pretty much only used the axe that entire game. Um, Alright, so let's do a different color here. I'm gonna go ahead and do gray. Volkov. I can't wait to Volkov. get new colors with Volkov. Like, home team colors look awesome. Black. I'm, I'm debating whether I should get Goldforge colors. What do you guys think? I mean, the Skyforge looks better with Volkov, I think. Maybe we'll go into uh, training and look at the Goldforge colors after this, because I really don't know if I want to get Goldforge for Volkov. I think I do, but we'll see. Alright, going against Clixy. Turn crossplay off? No, dude. Crossplay is fine. Crossplay is great. Everybody wanted crossplay. Alright, wait. Let's do it, boys! Caspian. Where are you going, Caspian? Where are you going? <laughs> he was probably lagging, I'm guessing? I don't know. Oh, what a turnaround! Down just a little bit faster than I could. Oh, hello. That's the mine I placed there for you, Caspian. Oh boy, he just got punched so hard in the face he died. I didn't think that would actually kill him. Final stocks. It all comes down to this.
GG, dude. GG. Threw the weapon at him, picked it back up midair, and then sliced him in the face to get that win. GG, dude. GG. All right, we're going to do one more game at least. I'm just getting warmed up. Yeah, let's look in training really quick. Training. Volkov Goldforge. All right, first of all, white and black. Look at black. It's so good. White's not bad, but it's like kind of just too much white. I wish they would have an accent color, like blue or something. Like, you know, like how they have the red with the uh, black. Red and black looks good. This is just white and more white and gray. Really, really uh, disappointing. Anyways, oh, look at that. Goldforge actually does look pretty dang cool now that I'm looking at it. I think I could even get gold forge right now if I wanted. I think. Do I have enough glory? Ah, yeah, I think I do. I don't think I had the Volkov high enough level when I first got the Skyforge colors for him. But now I do. Yep, I could buy gold forge Volkov right now if I wanted. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wait and right. see what the next legend looks like because if the next legend is really really cool i might want the glory to like get skyforge with him right away or her but if the next legend doesn't look that good then i'll get goldforge volkov probably i mean it's because like they will probably release a new legend before the ranked season ends you know what i mean so i'm gonna hold on to that glory as long as i can Scythe battles are fun, dude. Got you, bro! You saw me doing that and you still went into it. Oh boy, that one hurt. Oh my goodness. That was that was calculated there, Mirage. Oh, she got me with that. I don't know why I did that side stick. I was just I was just still laughing about that that bomb shenanigan that she did. Got you! Did you see his stock go from one to back to two really quick? Like, that was laggy. Alright, final stock. Oh my goodness, how did that not hit him? Oh, Mirage! 
Why you do it like that, bro? Why you do it like that? <sighs> Alright, I'm gonna randomize the weapons here a little bit. And uh, we'll do one more game. <laughs> if you guys enjoy, uh, please go ahead and drop a like. It really helps me out. And uh, be sure to subscribe for more Brahala content. Like I said, if you want to be in the live streams or you want to 1v1 me. I know a lot of people do. <laughs> because I see in the comments people are like, You're so bad, I could beat you. If you're one of those people, I invite you to my viewer lobbies. And I'll probably do something dumb like I just did there. Alright, go to get Vixalt. Maybe the V is silent, it's just Zal. Alright, another Mirage. I was thinking about playing Mirage for this video, but then I was like, mm, I just kind of want to play Volkov more. Mirage. You went under the stage and you tried to go back up through it. That's never a good thing. Did you drop something? You. We're looking at a three stock now, boys. She got me! Oh man, I thought I was clear there. GG. Oh man. That was a good session. Good session, right guys? Didn't do too great, didn't do too bad. But either way, got some practice in there with Volkov. Got him a little bit more experience. Got him to level 18 and unlocked the pink colors that I'll probably never use because they didn't do a good job. Should be more black and pink, you know? Anyways, guys. Hope you enjoyed. And I hope to see you in the next video. This is, or live stream. This is Lucian Sword. Take it easy, guys.